making a lot of progress on, um, on my old VODs. I have all of Torna scheduled now, and that is something that I was working on in the background, still trying to get through all of the VODs, all of the old VODs, before I can, um, feel more content with, with stream stuff. Um, mainly because when I started releasing things in mass, I was many different playthroughs behind, and now, as far as I can remember, it's only one or two missing Paper Mario streams. Uh, that one Persona stream I did a couple weeks ago, and Future Connected, and then three. So, not that much in the grand scheme of things, so it shouldn't be too, too hard to catch up. Um, so I'm definitely excited to, uh, to work through that, and having these there is one more, uh, one more step in that. <laughs> I'm gonna work on Future Connected soon, um, but for now, I think I'm gonna go play Spider-Man tomorrow. I know I mentioned that yesterday towards the end of the vlog for last week, but I definitely have been, like, thinking about it a lot. Uh, especially now that Paper Mario is, like, done for now. There's a fly in here, and I've been trying to get it, and I can't. Um, anyway, I'm excited to to start working through other games and try to get through that backlog, as well as this backlog for the streams. Wish me luck. I played Spider-Man. Spider-Man was fun. Um, it's been a while since I played and I can actually go like look this up because I know it's been a while. Yeah, so the last Spider-Man stream was May 7th, um, which was a while ago, and all of that went to, like, the wayside because of Paper Mario, because Paper Mario had the time limit of when Amber goes back to school, which is, like, today. Um, I think today was her first day of classes. Um, but now that Paper Mario is done and that she's back in school, I can play more of, uh, other games, which for now is probably going to be Spider-Man until I finish it. I don't know if I'm going to be doing a lot of, um, side stuff, because I want to know how the story ends. <laughs> when I ended today, I had gotten the, um, the symbiote off of Peter, and I need to go deliver it. And I imagine that this is going to be how Venom shows up, because I know Venom was in the trailers, but and the symbiote obviously leads to Venom, but... We'll see. <laughs> I'm very excited. If it's anything like the last game, I'll probably only be one more stream, maybe two. So, I'm looking forward to seeing how this ends. And hopefully it's satisfying. I got a package today. It's a new pair of shoes. Let's try them on. Well, initial reaction is they feel pretty nice. It is hard to, like, cage it until I, like, go out to work and use them. But they're mainly for work. I, um, I burn through my shoes a lot, so I'm trying to get something that's gonna last a little longer. And these have, like, big soles. So hopefully, um, they don't, like, get burnt down as quickly as some of the other shoes that I've worn. They're like, they're not cushioned the way that those, my usual shoes are. The the ones I usually wear are like memory foam, um, which is really nice until you wear them down too much. I was hoping this would be ready for truck, but it didn't get here in time. But it should help with, um, I, the floor there is so bad, it hurts to walk on after a while. So I'm hoping this like alleviates that some. We'll see. So I used the shoes today at work, um, and it worked pretty well. Um, I'm gonna continue to use them as like my main work shoes, and 
at some point I'm gonna use them for truck and see how they feel. But they came in yesterday after truck, so that didn't help me at all. Um, but I did get to use them on a normal work day before truck, so I guess I broke them in. <laughs> but uh, by and large they worked pretty damn well, so I'm gonna look forward to, to keeping them. They seem to be doing pretty good. Anyway, shoes are, uh, shoes are very good, and I got them for cheap, so I'm happy, so let's hope they stay good. So I bought a thing today. I bought the Sonic Origins collection, as well as Sonic Mania, and a couple of Mega Man collections, the Legacy 1 and 2 for the regular, for the original line of uh, 2D games. The, um, I had a $50 eShop gift card, and with that, I was able to buy a bunch of stuff because it was on sale. And I've never played Sonic, and I've never played Mega Man. So I was like, you know what? This sounds like a good idea. So I did it. Then I asked some friends for recommendations of which ones to start with. And basically, like, what are the highlights of the Sonic series? for both 2D and 3D. And so they told me, hey, play this, 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 and this, starting with Sonic 2. So I started playing Sonic 2, and I made it all the way to Death Egg. And I have been stuck on Death Egg. <laughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna be here a while because no rings, so you only have one hit, and you have to get through this robot Sonic, and then you can finally get to Eggman. So, definitely gonna be a bit. Definitely gonna be a bit. And it's frustrating because the rest of the game went by. It's just this one little bit of frustration. I, um... I was up late, so I'm very tired. Like 3 a.m. late, which is... Fun in the moment, but terrible in the aftermath. So I'm probably gonna sleep a lot. I hope. We'll see. But I try to keep this updated with how bad my sleep can get. So I uh, I just figured I would report it. And it wasn't even intentional. It kind of just happened. I was I was sitting in in a call and having fun. But, you know, time flies when you're having fun. So I'm gonna try to sleep. So wish me luck. When I got my laptop, my MacBook, Olivia was like, hey, can I have it? When you fix it, can I have it? I could use it, I really want it. And then she got her own. So, it's fine. And then hers broke. Some internal part, like, Jordan looked at it and I don't remember exactly what he said the problem was. But when he opened up, it was something he could not fix because it was like a very hard to come by, expensive-ish part. So, Olivia offered me an exchange. My MacBook for this laptop here which is running Windows 11. And this is Xbox. This Xbox, which is a Series S. Not a Series S, a 1S. I don't know if you noticed, but Xbox teams are not exactly coherent. Anyway, I flipped through Game Pass, and I saw some games I want to play, and I downloaded one of them. Yakuza Zero, which is um, a game I did a video visit of on Steam. I own it on Steam. But now I have it on Game Pass on my Xbox, so I'm probably going to play it on there. And it's going to be fun. I don't know when I'm going to get to it. I want to try to finish Sonic 2 first. But, um... Yeah. I'm excited to have this, because now... 
this shelf here with the Xbox games is not useless. So, I'm gonna go uh, play around with it some. And you can see I have the orange box in there. I'm gonna play Portal. So, I beat Portal. It was fun, as usual. I've never played it on console though, not fully through at least. Um, I know my uncle had the orange box when I was young and I saw him playing Portal. But um, I've never personally beaten it on console until tonight. So, this is fun. I mean, I'm gonna enjoy this a lot. But for now, that's it. I don't have anything else for this week. So, I'd like to thank you all for watching. Hope you had yourself a damn good one. And I'll see you next week.